all right what's going on guys it's zero here um it's been a minute since i posted up a video um i managed to squeeze this one in there um i am in the middle of editing certain other videos because i don't want to feel like i'm leaving you guys high and dry and stuff like that because that's what i feel like so i was just like fuck it i'm gonna i'm gonna make a video and i've been doing some more experimenting uh with johnny cage and i found out that he can actually get his crushing blow to come out um, or at least the last hit of his string to come out to where he gets the crushing blow and what I'm talking about is this one right here Right, so this move is still really really useless um, The reason why is because the second hit of the string is a high so the opponent can pretty much take advantage of this particular situation And prevent you from doing this so the way that this will actually work is if the opponent tech rolls backwards or they try to throw you the only way that they will throw you is if they know for a fact that you're respecting their defensive options way too much so with that being said I'm going to show you guys uh, pretty much two ways that you can pretty much uh, prevent the opponent from uh, escaping this, right? So in the beginning of the match, a lot of opponents tend to back up, which sets up Johnny Cage's shadow kick or his projectile, or he can pretty much go for this, right, to catch them off guard. But if they know that this move is a high, they're obviously going to uppercut you or down one you and pretty much prevent you from um doing that move and then you're going to be nervous to do it because the move is a high it's not a mid right so this creates a serious dilemma for you right so there is another way that you can actually get this out now keep in mind the move is still useless to try and go for i'm just throwing it out there uh it's not easy to get this going so the first option that the opponent is possibly going to do is they're going to try and tech roll backwards, right? So when they try to tech roll backwards, what's going to happen is that I'm going to uh, do this. And on prediction, if I time it correctly, that's what's going to happen. And as you can clearly see, the opponent just took substantial amount of damage. So that's a clear indication that this is highly effective against somebody that tries to tech roll. And if you see somebody tech rolling all the time, then this is a good way to pretty much get this out. Now, the other option is pretty much if they try to throw. Um, so if they try to throw you, right, um, what's gonna happen is, is that it's not gonna work, right? It's kind of like Johnny Cage ducked under the throw for a brief moment, and then he managed to get this out. See what I'm saying? So these are the two options that Johnny Cage pretty much has to take advantage of this particular situation. Um, and like I said, I'm not officially back on YouTube. I just felt kind of weird not posting up a video um, and giving you guys a quick update. I will be posting up um, some more videos, uh, but I just wanted to show you guys this. So with that being said, this is all I really had to say. Hopefully you guys are having a great day and stuff like that. And let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace.